Uh, hello everybody, and welcome back to some All the Mod 6 to the Sky. How you guys doing today? I hope you are doing well. I am. So, last episode, we got together and we got started on that up there. Some pneumatic craft. We are going to get to that in just a second. Uh, I've been a little bit busy in between episodes. Uh, I have got started on some mystical agriculture stuff. Stuff that we just going to go through and do. I'm going to attempt to make all of the seeds, or at least all of them that we can. Um, saltpeter seeds, uh, that's a pain in the butt to make. I don't know if we're going to make it or not. I don't know if we even have a reason to make it. Um, so yeah, there's that. Uh, so I've been working on those. Uh, I have got uh, our Supremium armor made. Uh, I don't have any of the stuff to do uh, the flight yet. Uh, to do that, we've got to get into Gillen the Wither, and we're going to have to get into Man of Steel. Not that hard to do. We can do that, but we don't have to right now. Um, I also made a backpack to carry a few things in, um, and that's pretty much it. I've been working on smelting some stuff up. we got some stuff going here. Uh, other than that, that's it. All right, so let's get into what we're going to do today. Um, this thing is rolling. We're sitting at five on the uh, air. Uh, this thing is sitting on five. Uh, it's not going to blow up. We got the security upgrades in there. It's great. I love it. We're backed up on lava. We're good to go there. So what are we going to do? Well, first things I want to do. Uh, I want to get us into this little chicken is following me around everywhere. Uh, I want to get into getting our speed upgrades. Uh, this guy right here, this one can go away. Uh, for speed upgrades, we're going to need to get us uh, some lubricant. And with that, we looked at that. Um, we can do it with vile diesel or diesel, uh, but. We're going to make the Amadron tablet. We can get, we've got plenty of emeralds. We can get a bucket for five. That's what we're going to do. So let's get our Amadron tablet up here. Uh, we are also going to need a charger for this. Uh, this guy right here. Um, this one, I don't know exactly how much it, we can do this pretty quick and easy. Like, uh, I put all this stuff in here. Uh, I need reinforced stone, which I do not have. So that was that. And some other stone. So my goal today is to try to get us to the point where we are, um, getting everything together for the botany pots uh i'm hoping we can do all that today that's the plan uh i need three bricks I just so happen to have three and i really need a crafting table somewhere uh we're out of pipe we need some more pipe that'll work all right so let's do this let's do that let's get where we need to pop and that guy all right there's that taken care of we need the amadron tablet we're going to need plastic before we can do that what a load of crap um all right so speed upgrade is off the counter for the moment we need plastic sheets and to do the plastic sheets we need to get molten plastic which we need to get this guy right here. This is the whole purpose of us. Well, that's the first purpose of us getting the oil. Uh, we're going to need. Uh, I forgot what that thing's called. This guy right here. Refinery. Oh, there's more than one thing here. Um, refinery controller. This is. Needs that. Says by default, oils process into that. Two, three, or four refinery outputs need to be stacked on top of each other to work. You will get the best results with four refinery outputs. So we need to get four refinery outputs. Those aren't that hard to do. We're going to have to get some more reinforced stone. The controller is a small fluid tank, which isn't that bad. All right. So that 
is what I'm fixing to do. I bet. Alright, so we are back. I've got stuff set up here. Uh, it's kind of a crude setup right now, but uh, with what we got, we've got what we got. So, this guy here needs um, heat in order for it to, uh, to do its thing. Now, there, we can, it, we, there's several ways you can do this. Uh, you can... Well, let's go in here and look. Give me this. Uh, you can use vortex tubes, um, stuff like that to heat it, but you can also use lava. Lava is fast, but it solidifies. So, we've got this set up here. Uh, we just need to give it some power. Uh, it'll place lava down in that spot right there. And then we've got... I need to get some more blocks. Uh, then I've got a block breaker here. This guy will break the blocks. Uh, we'll br break the obsidian. I'm hoping it'll break them pretty quick. If not, we can add some uh, speed upgrades to it uh, to make it faster. Um, it's kind of the sort of cheap... I cannot find any blocks. Uh, it's kind of the really the cheap and easy way of doing this without having to get creative with vortex tubes and finding the perfect heat and everything like that so all we need to do is give both of these guys a little bit of power uh let's i tell you what let's put a piece of glass down here so i can actually that doesn't do one. Oh, i had to make a new pickaxe i threw mine off in the void uh, let's go here and do that. Let's throw this guy here. Let's do that right there. That way we can see what we've got going on. Let's give this guy some power. Are you going to place... That should be placing lava. Why are you not placing lava? Do I need to give it a bucket? Alright, well, we should have went with this fluid placer anyways, because it does not take any kind of power to use. But it's going. This thing is heating up. All we need to do now is give it its bit of oil. Uh, so let's put that there. Let's get us another fluid pipe. Let's do that. Let's do that, and we should, uh, refineries need to be stacked on top of each other, we've got that, heat, that's going, this should, we're getting diesel, we're getting gas, we're getting LPG, and we're getting kerosene, beautiful, alright, so, now, to get the plastic, we need to get the molten plastic, which we need to make the little processing plant, and we need to give it any one of these. LPG is probably, well, I guess either one of them will work. Um, so, LPG, coal, produce plastic. Beautiful. That's all we should need for it. So, let's get this guy made. It doesn't look like it's that hard to do. Just some more crafting stuff. All right, well, we should have went the same way with the other one. Uh, the industrial foregoing block breaker was not working for that. Uh, so I placed uh, the cyclic one, and it seems to be working just fine. So now we're... Oh, I need an uh, empty hand to do this. Um, we're getting uh, all the stuff. Uh, like I said, LPG is where we need to be. I tell you what we'll do, though. Let's throw a little time in the bottle in here. And, yeah, there we go. All right, so now back to what we were making anyways. I need to make this guy right here, the thermo pneumatic processing plant. All right, so I run this down and around uh, to the other side just because that's the side that our LPG is on. So we should be able to throw coal in here. Uh, so temperature needs to be higher than that. Um, 
this might be where we decide we need to make one of these vortex tubes, I do believe. Uh, let's check these things out. Um, splits incoming air into hot and cold. Depends. Okay. So this guy, pretty easy to make. All we need is a couple pieces of gold. There we go. We should have everything else. And this should have a hot and cold side to it. So we do, that's the cold side. That's not the side that I want. Can we just... Aha! That's what we need. And... Let's just run another tube to it. And we're getting our plastic. Beautiful. Hopefully that'll all hold up. We're getting our liquid plastic. Now, the only thing about this that has changed. Now, we can set this up later to be a little bit more automated with this. Uh, but in order to get our plastic, that's what we've got to do. Um, basically, we could just make us another fluid placer and set it up that way. Uh, Alright, so to get our Amadron tablet, we need one, two, three, four, five, six. Shit. Alright, so we are back. Uh, server is now updated. Uh, and if we go here and look, we've got a whole new section dedicated to bees, uh, and to mystical agriculture. So we are going to have to make all the seeds. Uh, the saltpeter seed doesn't look like it is, it is in here. Uh, so we will have to vent nitrate dust. That's nitrate ingot. How do we get that? We'll have to figure that out later. Anyways, so now we're back to what we were doing, uh, which is getting our Amadron tablet. Uh, I've got to put stuff together. We've got everything we need for that. Uh, I don't have, I need to bring me a crafting table up here. All right, so we've got everything we need now. Uh, we've got this guy here. We should be able to shift right click on that, shift right click on that. Now these two are bound to this. We can put our emeralds in there. We just need to give this thing some air. Now, this is not going to fill up very far. Um, it's going to get us to um, five. We don't need a full tablet to use it. Um, so we should be good. All right. So now that we've got this all set up, let's go in here and find our... Uh, we want to place an order. We want engineer's blueprint. That's good to know. Uh, we want this guy right here. And we want to get as many as we can. I... How many does this hold? Uh, this holds 64 buckets. Um, that's 24 buckets. Let's just go ahead and we're out of items to sell. Let's place order. And we should see a little drone come. There he is. He's going to take our emeralds. He'll take off. Come back with our lubricant. Now, switch these out. Uh, if we use these tanks, we can actually use them and craft at the same time. So there we go. We're getting all of our lubricant. We've got that. We've got 25 buckets worth, which is beautiful. I about let that go off. And now all we need to do is get us a little bit of lapis and a little bit of sugar.
and now we should be able to make our speed upgrades. Let's do that. Let's do that. That give us 15. That should be good enough for what we need. Now we can come up here and place these on both sides. Throw some in there. We'll throw some in this side. And then all we need to do now is hook us up some chest and we'll be ready to use this thing. Alright, so I've got the pipes hooked up, got chests hooked up, we made these ultimate pipe upgrades. Uh, that way we can pump items in faster and suck them out faster. So, we are working towards, we need to make uh, the PCBs. This is where we're headed. Um, of course, we want to get to where we are crafting these, we can do that that way. Uh, unassembled uh, we got to do this the hard way the first time um, which means we need a etching tank which is actually something that's new um, and then we need to make a few of these empty PCBs which that's easy enough to do I don't have anything for what I needed so let's grab some of that I had sticks. No, no. Uh, we need redstone torches. How many do I need for each of these? That's just that's two. I need one more stick. Let's do that. Uh, I'm out of redstone. Well, I'm not out of redstone, but uh, so this guy, that guy. There's that. We need. Three gold nuggets for each one of these. There's that. And then we need two pieces of plastic. Beautiful. Alright, let's go throw this stuff in here and see how this works out for us. This thing should be... Uh, the pressure went down a little bit. But that's because we've got all this other stuff hooked to it right now. So half, half, and half. Uh, shoot. I've got this wrong. Let's fix it. Now that should suck in there. Uh, well, it's already done. All right, so let's do that one. Beautiful. Oh, it's working like a charm. All right, so next up, we need to make this etching tank, which we need a small tank, which I still have uh, one of those left. We need these guys. And I need some slabbage and I need two pieces of obsidian which we should have right over here and oh we need a glass pane one last glass pane all right etching tank beautiful now this guy um Fill with etching acid, can be heated for faster etching. Um, etching acid will be slowly used when heated. Uh, so let's just place this down. This is actually something new. Um, it doesn't need... Uh, so we just need to give it some etching acid. All right, let's go place this down up here if we need some heat. Actually, you know what we could do for heat? Let's see about using... I made a bunch of those. Let's try this. Let's see how this works out. Uh, let's just go, like, right over here. I need some blocks. 
All right, so this guy just showed up, and he actually has beacons for sale. Um, I don't know if we can break anything down in this pack or not, but what we are going to do, we've got plenty of emeralds. Let's go buy one. And that's all we're going to get. So now uses with that... Now, it doesn't look like we've got any way to do it, but we do need one of these. So we've got at least one of those. Nice. All right. Um, I forgot what I was doing. Oh, yeah. I come down here to get some blocks. All right. So not getting stuff done here. All right, so we want this guy there, there, there. It's all right. This guy here, put this guy on top of it. That is getting some heat. We just need to make some etching acid. And to make the etching acid, we need spider eyes, rotten flesh, plastic, and that is going to be where we have our first issue. Uh, because I don't have any spider eyes just yet. Let's get that. Um. Hmm. I know where we can get some right quick. Uh, because my farm's not big enough for it. We've got to get that set up. I was not aware of this. So, we are going to go visit David. Because I know, let's wait, let's turn our, our magnet is off. Let's go see if he's got some we can borrow. Um, let's see here. Uh, yeah, he's got a few. Thanks, David. Actually, you know what? We're going to borrow some flesh. Because I don't have any flesh either. I used all of it to make leather. Beautiful. I owe him. I owe him and I owe you. Alright, so we've got... So we need just gunpowder. And gunpowder we have plenty of. Beautiful. All right. So this is what? Two, 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 and then the bucket. Bucket, one, two, one, two, one, two. Beautiful. Now let's throw this in here. Let's get us an empty PCB. Uh, wait, why are... Oh, we got it. Shoot, I forgot about that. We got to make the light box. Man, I tell you what. Uh, we need our Amadron back. Alright, so Amadron, we need... Why? Oh, I need to put emeralds in here. Uh, we need this guy right here. Alright, so we got it made. We got this thing in here. He is being done. Let's just, for the sake of hurrying up and getting stuff done, let's just do that. And... That's actually cool. I like the way that looks. So there we go. There's that guy. This goes into here. And now it's just a matter of waiting on this guy to be done. So let's do the same thing. Speed it up a little bit. It's done. We've got an unassembled PCB. This guy... Is what we need for that. Now, we can take care of some of this process. Um, so let's go in here. Uh, we're going to need an assembly assembly platform. 
we're going to need a export we're going to need um, let's see here unassembled we need a export import and a laser we've got the export the laser and the import beautiful and then we're also going to need the assembly program laser which is gotten from our this uh, that's drill that's drill and laser we might as well just go ahead and get this guy it'll take care of both of them for us I do believe all right well that took some time and some work to do uh, this thing kept running out of heat it's still got issues biggest problem that it has is we've got too much stuff hooked up to these couple of air compressors uh, which we're going to address that, uh, but not right this minute. Basically, what we're wanting to get to is us making these PCBs the easy way. So, we still got to do these guys, which is making those. Now, to get the unassembled one, we can just run these through here. Uh, and with the unassembled ones, we can do the printed ones, and the printed ones is what gets us to... Our bonsai pots which um, we need just a bunch of plastic so that is kind of where we are at right this minute I've got to get plastic going um, we need I'm try, still trying to figure out if this is really easier or whether or not it's easier or not uh, than what Batania is um, We've got, we can use this guy now to make the advanced compressor. The advanced compressor will give us um, more, um, it'll give us more air, uh, but it also has more heat to it. So that's kind of a, a, a thing with it. Uh, but we're going to go ahead and make one of these things. Uh, they shouldn't be that hard for us to do now. We can make these guys, uh, which takes uh, either a block of compressed iron. That's probably the easiest way to do it. So let's just go ahead and do that. I already got a bunch of those. Um, so let's see if we can get this guy to work. Make sure we've got everything hooked up, ready to go. Uh, if I throw that in there. He's still hanging pretty good. Basically, the more power or the more air we can give this guy, the faster he's going to run. Um, how are we doing? It's he's still holding in there pretty good. Uh, we can give it uh, not that. If I wanted to grab two of those out of there. So this was pretty fast. Do that. Still holding its air pressure. And there we go. This guy is now working. So now we've got these. These guys are better. We can, like I said, we can make this guy right here. So let's go ahead and do that, at least for this part of this, right this minute. All right, so we've got this guy. He's getting way on up air pressure now. Um, this guy is ready to go. So we've got that taken care of. Um, I want to go ahead and upgrade all of this. Uh, shouldn't be that bad to do. I just need to get us a handful of uh, blocks. Let's go ahead and run these guys again. All right, so um, I've cleaned this up a little bit. Uh, not much, but we do have... Um, the uh, advanced air compressors these guys are going to slowly start building up uh, cool machine down under the 50 yeah see that's 
we're gonna be burning through lava it'll work um the way it is but it won't it's gonna burn lava faster so we're probably gonna have to uh upgrade our lava here just a little bit but everything is working as it should this guy's good to go he's actually yeah he's where he needs to be i love the fact that that just follows you around uh these are filling up he's got pressure he's filling up rather nicely uh he's I i'm working on speed upgrades for everything that'll kind of help with some of this stuff um but the basic part of it is done now as far as automating this all we really need to do from this point is set this up with uh being able to throw coal in here anywhere or not anywhere but being able to throw coal in here to keep it full and using a fluid placer uh to place the plastic and just something like an absorption hopper to suck up the plastics that take care of automating that and then these guys all we got to do is set up a uh with what we're going to use refined storage um so we can set a crafter up to the chest and run everything through and all this would be automated um so yeah uh as far as everything goes this is all pretty much done i don't know how much more we can really do as far as um i don't know how these things work um yeah i have no idea uh i gotta do some more looking some of this stuff has changed from the last time i use it i'm not i'm not very efficient at setting it up but i can get it set up to where we can go so but like i said we are set ready to go more or less all i need to do now is collect a bunch of plastic so we can do a whole bunch of uh, we got to do a bunch of the transistors. We got to do a bunch of the capacitors. This stuff's all easy stuff. Worst part about this is getting the plastic. Um, and I don't think, I don't know, can we ever get to a spot where we've got like a creative tank or something? Um, that's energy, creative fluid tank. That's not what we need. Um... Well, may not yet. I know they're adding some. We got the creative compressor. What do we need for that? Uh, AT. Oh. Oh. Um. Yeah. Holy crap. Creative essence isn't quite as bad. Insanium, insanium gemstone block. Okay, that's a lot of insanium. We need to get that going. Creative vending upgrade. There's a creative storage upgrade. Yeah, this guy is... Whew. That's a lot of stuff. I didn't even think about looking at any of that. I forgot they added all that. All right, anyways, I'm just rambling now. We've got basically everything we need to get this thing going it's more or less just a matter of letting everything charge up and getting the plastic so with that i hope you guys enjoyed the episode thank you for watching and i will see you guys next time bye